that's just like when you see these boats and stuff set here today, it's a shame. It hurts my heart to see them here tied to the dock. I, I, I was just telling him a while ago, I worked with a man for 13 years kicking clams, and I'd be caught on limit every day. And it just got to the point, he just, he was one of them and says, well, I'm not going to do it no more. And now the boat's going sold, she's going off. And uh, that went my job for, that went my job that I was doing all winter to, to pay my winter bills that I bought my Christmas with, my youngest. Well, that was took from me because they just won't give you that, and that man was fed up with it. Now he's going on and got on a dress boat, and he's doing well. But that's just not for everybody. What I mean is just like me. I've tried it three or four years. But to be going and never be home and never be around your family, it, it, I just can't do it. I'm a family man, and I love the water, and I want to work and catch fish, and I want to go oyster, I want, and I go scalloping, and I want to go shrimping, and I'm going to keep doing it as long as I can. I'm, I'm, I'm one of the ones that's going to keep struggling and do it. As long as I can keep my head afloat and keep something to eat on my table, I'm going to do it. Granddaddy used to live with just buying salt and uh, grease and that sugar, and that was it. I just didn't have no lights. You paid the doctor with a chicken or a hog or something like that. The doctor ain't gonna accept the chicken or the hog no more. So you're caught up in life cycle. Because everybody else does it.